Have you ever used AI for your assignment and then panic that it will get tagged as AI generated? The truth is AI content is very easy to spot. But what if I tell you that you can still use ChatGPT and maintain your professional credibility? I'm going to show you how to use AI tools confidently and pass every detection test. Plus, how to humanize AI generated text. Most people copy the content from ChatGPT without adding any human touch. But I have a solution for you. You can humanize AI generated text for free. I used to panic a lot about AI detection until I found this method. You can use it too and never worry about detection ever again. So let's get started. The first step is to create a paragraph from an AI tool. For this, I will go to ChatGPT and say, explain prompt engineering in 100 words. And this is what we get. Now, let's scan it on an AI detection tool. This one is zero GPT. Let me paste the paragraph generated by ChatGPT and click on this button, detect text. As you can see, it shows the entire text is AI generated and it also highlights which part of the paragraph is AI generated in the yellow highlighted section. Here, the entire paragraph is yellow, which means it's 100% AI generated. Now, let's try another famous tool, Quillbot. So you can see there is no surprise here also. We knew that this paragraph will be labeled as AI generated. It's very easy to spot an AI generated paragraph. Have you ever thought how do these AI detectors detect that this particular content is AI generated? Basically, there are two broad reasons. Usually, they're looking for predictability and monotony. AI tends to choose the most statistically probable words or very formal words. And this makes the language too smooth, perfect and unoriginal without any errors. The more the predictability, higher are the chances of text being AI generated. As you can see, the paragraph generated by ChatGPT had high predictability. The second broad category is monotony. AI tools often produce sentences of similar length and tone. They don't have the natural rhythm or variations that a human would use when writing text. Humans usually use a mix of long and small sentences. The higher the monotony factor, the higher the chances of it being AI generated. And as you can guess, the paragraph that we generated from ChatGPT was monotonous. And therefore, whenever we want to humanize the content, we have to consider these two parameters. Now, let's ask ChatGPT to humanize the paragraph. Let me give this prompt to ChatGPT. Add a flow and rhythm to the paragraph. Add some natural imperfections like tiny errors and pauses. Use conversational words over formal jargons. And avoid rigid formatting like bullets, repetitive patterns or overly neat structure. This prompt will make sure that the response has some errors, a mix of long and short sentences and conversational words. Basically, we want low predictability and low monotony. Let me press enter and see this is the text generated by ChatGPT. Now, let's pass it again via the AI detection tools. Copy paste it on 0GPT, click on detect text and let's see the results. So this says it's 0%. This is good news because that means that ChatGPT was able to humanize the text. Now let's pass it to the other tool that we were using, Quillbot. And this says it's 16%. Okay, so different tools have come up with different probabilities and this is not good because it's not certain. Plus I want 100% humanized text and 0% AI generated text. So let's try to use some other tools to humanize the content. And for this, we are going to use that tool called Uncheck AI. So the interesting thing about this tool is that it creates 100% human-like content undetectable by most AI detectors. The common ones are 0GPT, Quillbot, which we used earlier, and it also checks against originality.ai, Turnitin, CopyLeaks, GPT-0 and Winston AI. We will paste the original response from ChatGPT. Now on the top, you see that there are different modes, advanced, instant and precise. So advanced is already selected. We'll keep it like that because we want 100% humanized text. After generating the text, it is also checking against the AI detection tools. And you can see all of them have shown that it's 100% human written. So that's good news. But let's check again and run this paragraph in our original AI detection tools. Let's copy it and paste it on 0GPT. It says the text human written, that is 0% AI generated. And let's use Quillbot. And it also passes the text and it thinks that it's human generated. So the first method of humanizing text with ChatGPT was free, but it's not 100% foolproof. And if you want foolproof method, you can use the tool Uncheck AI. 
with the help of this tool anytime you have to submit a presentation or a research paper or an assignment you wouldn't have to worry about it being getting tagged as ai generated this makes me curious what all other things can i do with chat gpt watch this video to know six secrets about chat gpt to beat everyone else around you i'll see you in the next video until then take care and bye bye